All right, boys, we back in it. About to go meet up with the uncle, see what's up. <laughs> um, I'm still pretty upset about how the last one ended. You know, the boy Miles uh, kind of feel like he could he could have he could have done better. You know, but let's not live in the past. Getting close to the docks. Hope Uncle Aaron's there. Let's see how this is gonna turn out. All right. I gotta call you back. Oh. Hi, right, Miles. Spill it. Give me the whole situation. Vin, rocks on, underground. It's just a lot, you know. You're 17. You're stressed, and you're a superhero. You gotta cut yourself some slack. You still making beats? And not much since I started this work-life balance kid most important thing here little project your dad and i started back in the day a mixtape had rhymes ready in everything how come i never heard about this because we never finished we sampled street noise around the way wanted the city to be our beat but your dad had the masters and after things went bad between us but you can finish what we could Plus, it'll take your mind off work Yeah Yeah, okay What do I do? Load that up, I'll walk you through it I set up holograms to guide you Scan the source Holograms, huh? You still in my moves? <laughs> this was in my playbook before you even born, young blood Okay. Let's see what's cooking. Let's go. Okay. Don't think about Finn. Focus on sounds. Clear my head. Scan the holograms and it'll unlock files on that drive I gave you. Help you figure out which sound you're looking for. Now try and find the original sound and grab a clean sample. Hmm. Good sound, but it's muffled. Try and get a clear line of sight. Need to get a little further away so it doesn't distort. Not a match, though. Keep looking. Hmm. No, nah, that's not it. Okay. Do I have to? St oh yeah. I, okay, I see where I need to stay. I can go over here a little bit. No, let me go up. Let me go up. Okay. Ooh, too far. And okay. Let's see. That might be it might be but i think we might need to get closer hmm can i can i get over here pretty sure no nah, it's not over here eh? i'm not done yet don't leave a thing half done then dad taught me that hmm i feel like it's not supposed to be this hard What am I missing? Need to be a little closer to get your levels right. Okay. There you go. So I was right. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Okay. Let's see. They try. Oh, these are just um. Rest of the sounds you need are spread across the city. I left a few messages for you too, to help you get a feel for each location. Oh, dope. Okay. Hmm. 
Not now. Hey, get some you like? <laughs> yeah, really unique dynamics. See, old man still knows his stuff. <laughs> and you were right about clearing my head too. I know what to do about Finn. I gotta see her. Try to talk her out of all this. In person? Where? Trinity Church. Tomorrow night. Why so interested? Because you got a target on your back the size of Jersey. You don't have to protect me. Someone should. <sighs> you know, you said you never finished this tape because of how things went bad between you and Dad. What actually happened between you two? It was complicated. You were too similar. Too different. <sighs> Finish the tape, get all the samples, and you'll hear the whole story. Promise. All right. Thanks, Unc. I get the feeling that Prowler is back to being Prowler. This is not good. Trinity Church. Remember, Tinker is yours, but leave the boy alone. Yeah. This is, I figured something like this, man. Uh, I'm, I'm kind of sad. Aaron, why, why, why are you going to do my guy like that? Man, I needed that. I was beat. All right, so. Okay, I'm going to call Finn as soon as I'm ready to go. Hold on, what? There's something else. Mom? Genki? I was going to the window. Anyone home? I think it's just me. Really? Just like that? <laughs> okay. Alright, so that little mission with my uncle is done. What's next? I guess we could do some side missions. Let's do this one right here. What is this? These are tar All right, let's just go down here and see what's going on. Brave man sticking around after that bridge stunt. You really spilled the milk on that one. <laughs> see what this guy says. Yo, what up, my guy? Not trying to talk to us, or are we going? Spider Man, hey, I'm Caleb. What? Oh, that's the other guy, but I'm still here to help. <sighs> Every business on this block's had inventory stolen over the last few weeks paper products, kits, sanitizers. We're all local. We can't swallow a loss like that. Did you report it? Sure, but no one's taking us seriously. Camila, she runs the restaurant next door, decided to look into it herself. Went down to the shipping center that supplies all of us. I'll meet her there. See if I can help. Thanks, Spider-Man. Good to have you looking out for us. Do you guys see that little hiccup there where it kind of went quiet for a little bit? I've been seeing a bunch of those. Well, they're not that frequent, but still, it's it's pretty annoying. Okay. Hey, Genki. I'm looking into some robberies on Harlem's main strip. Caleb's clean cuts and Pana Fuerte. Oh, I love Pana Fuerte. Did you try the arepas? I can't eat before I do intense superheroing. It's kind of like pool rules. Right, totally. So, what's the plan? Track down the stolen inventory, find out who did it, see if it's connected to the guy who robbed Tails Bodega. Sounds good. I'm on call for tech, map, and thinking through problem support. No, <laughs> okay. But yeah, as I was saying in regards to those little hiccups where it kind of like cuts out some of the stuff. The same was the case for like the original Spider-Man game. Insomnia gotta clean that up. Alright. So it's so right around the next block. Here. That's the shipping center that supplies Caleb's block. Cops? What's going on? 
Witness said a woman was stuffed in a trunk after arguing with some ex-con types. We got an ID. From an Oscorp cam. Camilla Vasquez owns Pana Fuerte in Harlem. Oh my god. They kidnapped Camila. I had to try and find her. But cops won't like me interfering. Maybe if I get a look at the clues. Hold on, what? Camila definitely fought back. Need to figure out where they took her. Parking garage receipt. Chinatown. Okay. Okay. But where in Chinatown? Okay, let me... That could have been really bad. We gotta look for some more clues, but I gotta just wait a sec. Uh get enough camouflage energy i haven't seen the other spider-man in a while maybe he retired and left new york in the hands of a kid that's what retiring is johnny yeah it just seems irresponsible <laughs> okay let's go back down Oop, this been working a lot of overtime we're always short staffed around the holidays someone's got a volunteer you're the only one with Spider-Man, this is an active crime scene. Back off or I'll take you in for obstruction. My bad. I need to make myself harder to spot. Yo, what happened with the subways? This new spider apparently fixed the train. That's what the local... Well, at least he's doing some gas. Okay, so we're running out of camouflage energy real quickly. And apparently this is not where we need to be, so... No, it is where we need to be, it's just a matter of... Hard to tell what's important and what's trash. Robberies were reported up north by a guy named Caleb Ward. Could be connected. Yeah, I don't see nothing else down here that... Could help us besides that jacket. Oh, you know what? I am an idiot. That's what we should have done. Uh... I am an idiot. Exactly what we should have done. Jacket from David's complete auto repair. Someone dropped it when they peeled out. Hey, you know where I could find David's complete auto repair? There's 12 of them in Manhattan. Any in Chinatown? Yep. Sending you the address. All right. So, <laughs> should have uh, figured that's what we needed to do. Interesting. As soon as I find where I need to go. Hey Spider-Man. Any leads on our M tour? Yeah. The guys who stole it? I think Camila caught them in the act. They kidnapped her. What? You're sure? Positive. I'm on my way to help her. <sighs> Good thing you came by when you did, Spider-Man. Thank you. Let's see if we can go save this lady. Hmm. Let's see. If we go through here, we should be able to get there faster. Alright. Should be around the next block. Alright, so it's right in here. Yep. Get the hell away from me, cops! Everybody go! Oh, come on, car chase, really? How are we gonna cut this guy off? You're gonna make a circle. Gotta keep up. Please be okay. 
okay, Camila? Bro, is this guy an idiot? He's just literally going in a circle. Or am I supposed to just go down to a lower level? Hang on, Camilla. I'm gonna save you, Camilla. Bro, you know what? I'm gonna try and latch on to one of those police cruisers. We can just cut him off. Ooh. Ah, come on. Camilla, you okay in there? Help! Please! Okay, this guy. Enjoy your nap. We got it, we got it, we got it. Easy money, we got it. Nice. So that took me a while. <laughs> Need to get that trunk open. Please help me. Oop. My bad. Alright. Are you okay, ma'am? Spider-Man, I, I I didn't expect you to. But those men. It's okay now. You're safe. They, those men were paid to steal our inventory, drive us out of business. They're holding it at the docks on FDR, near the bridge. I'll get your stuff back. Do you need help getting home? No, 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 I can call a cab. Gracias. You saved my life, sir. Ooh, that's a, that's a bit of a trip. All right. Let's see if we can do this quick time. Yankee. Camila's safe. She caught those guys stealing inventory. Said someone paid them to do it. About that, I did some digging. Someone anonymously filed a request with the city to use eminent domain powers and condemn Camila and Caleb's block. Has to be the guy paying our criminals, right? So he can move in? Totally. I put in a counter request asking for an investigation into whoever's trying to buy the land. Dude, you're a genius. I'm headed to the docks to get the supplies back. Call you soon. Yo, Genki's working overtime. You love it. Let's see if we can actually get these supplies back for these people. All right. Crates, crates, more crates. Where'd they hide the supplies? Bet those guys know. If I listen in, I can figure out which crate to open. What do you think he's gonna build on the land? Apartments, maybe. Office space. Gonna run drugs out of them? Probably. Good way to make money quick. Not in my neighborhood, it's not. Can't hear them through the container. What are you planning to do with that stuff? Barber shears, napkin holders? Probably dump it. You can get started if you want. Green crate with the white star. Got it. Now I can take these guys down. A lot of guys. Let's make it faster. Alright. You're going to sleep. Oh, this big guy is here. Ooh. Yeah, this big guy is gonna be a problem. All right, I see it. Okay, so you have a gun. You could be a problem. Oof. Crowbar to the jaw. Okay, you're a, so you're a savage. Okay, you you gonna hit me with a crowbar? Okay, I'm giving you an extra helping just for that. Harlem one, 
off a guy's working for mystery boss? Zero. Now to find the goods. Green container, white star. Green container. Green container, white star. <laughs> Green container, white star. Okay, hold on. I see something up here. Let's see if I pull that. If I pull that down. And whip it up. What happens? Got it. And now to get that inventory out of the crate. For real? More of you? Your boss gave you rocket launchers? This guy's serious. Toast. The guy with the next rocket launcher. Oh, he's loser. Now then, let me go get my stuff. Well, it's not my stuff technically. Oh yeah. This is it. All the stolen supplies. Hey Caleb, found your inventory. Bring a few trucks down to the docks, and I hope you move it back. We were ready to file for bankruptcy and close our doors for good. Because of you, we're back on our feet. Thank you. A thousand times. Thank you. You ever need a haircut, drop by. It's on the house. Uh, how would that work with the mask? <laughs> I've seen stranger. Oye, you need food too. You're a growing boy. Mira, come by Pana Fuerte anytime. We'll wrap up something nice for you, okay? Appreciate it, both of you. Everyone on the block feels the same. You've done us good, Spider Man. See, that I can rock with. Oh, nice. A, block, a bunch of XP. Doing good work out there, Spider Man. With your help. Any leads on our mystery guy? Yeah, I'm working on a short list. So far, I've got Vulture, Scorpion, Tombstone. Don't think Electro could pull off something like this. That's a lot of big names, but we'll deal. I want them out of our neighborhood. Aw, it's the first time you've called it ours. Don't make it weird. Too late. It's already weird. That was pretty cool, though. All right, time to call Finn. Hope she answers. Hi, Spider-Man. Finn, hey, we need to talk in person. So you can lie to me again? So I can make this right. Please. Meet me at Trinity Church. No more lies. I promise. If you're screwing with me, fine. I'll see you there. At least she's willing to meet. Okay. Trinity Church. Let's go. Bruh. Oh, it's ooh, it's deep. Alright, boys. It's gonna be a bit of a journey so i will catch you guys when we get there things are getting hella spicy it's gonna be interesting to see Ooh, we got one of the challenges from my mans here we'll leave that for another time so yeah as i was saying um ooh, podcast hello friends this is the danicast with our debate it's that's your intro blame we in the business call that burying the lead Oh, let me ask you something, Danny. Do you ever think about what you're inciting? About your journalistic integrity? More than some. Because your campaign against Roxxon is baffling to an actual journalist like myself. You should be attacking the young, unproved vigilante who keeps causing problems in Harlem. What? You 
You twist everything Spider-Man does into something malicious while simultaneously excusing everything Roxxon does wrong. All Spider-Man needs for you to support him is to get a better PR department. Uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. The only problem Spider-Man fixes are the ones he causes. I won't praise the arsonist for putting out his fire. Meanwhile, Roxxon built a beautiful plaza in a failing neighborhood. By tearing down homes and businesses, our new Spider-Man is proving that Harlem isn't the failure Roxxon makes it out to be. And you, Mr. Jameson, for someone who claims to love New York, you sure do seem to hate New Yorkers. You are clearly emotional, young lady, so I'm invoking the mercy rule on this debate. <laughs> Jared, shut it down! And whose idea was it to debate a teenager? There are no good objects to destroying a child! Just come! I need a hot stone massage! Yeah, but that's... Well, thanks for the debate that you demanded, Mr. Jameson. To everyone else, remember to stand up every half hour while working at a computer. Bye. I swear, I can't with JJ, bro. I can't. He's actually deranged. But he's a nice touch to this story, you know? So it's nice that he's here. But I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace.